Dear friends, you might have often seen that when a small kid watches a superhero movie, he begins to think of himself as a superhero. He wears some kind of superhero clothes and jumps here and there. He plans a dream for himself where he flies in air and helps the needy. But then suddenly his parents shout at him saying, "Hey, stop jumping. You are not a superman. You are just a human being." Next day, the kid goes to school and tells his friend about his superman dream and how he will help others. And then his friends say, "Hey, don't be a fool. This happens only in movies." Listening to all this, the unique child grows up blending into a society that says you are just a human being. And if he says he is a superhero, society makes fun of him calling him a fool. Dear friends, always remember that only fools create history and smarter ones study the history. Don't ever let the superhero within you die. Renowned motivational speaker Dr. Vivek Bindra says Some people are busy cramming the history while some are busy creating the history. There are two kind of people in the world. Some are busy cramming the history, some are busy creating the history. Kis jagah pe hain aap? Author Robin Sharma in his book The 5 AM Club tells about the four focuses of history makers and today we will be talking about these four focuses. So, let's know what are the four things that history makers always focus on. Number 1 capitalization IQ This simply means that you must capitalize your IQ and potentials In schools we are often told that Albert Einstein was a genius because he had an extraordinary brain Students accept this fake reality that they cannot be a genius like Einstein Similar to the superhero within a child students limit their thinking they limit their potentials they live their life thinking success is achieved only by natural or god gifted talent this perspective of looking at the world is absolutely wrong if god gift was everything then neither would mark zuckerberg waste 6 years at writing the facebook program nor would elon musk succeed at his fourth attempt at spacex after failing in his first 3 so stop looking at the world with a wrong perspective and always remember hard work beats talent when talent does not work hard Number 2 freedom from distraction in his book author says an addiction to distraction is the death of your creative production an addiction to distraction is the death of your creative production don't manage your time instead manage your focus prefer completing one work instead of 10 incomplete works prefer being a master of one game instead of an average player of all games even bill gates says I succeeded in my life because I focused on very few things. Freedom from distraction not only means you must stay away from social media, but it also means that once you take up one work, you must not be distracted by your other works. Number 3, personal mastery practice. Spartan warrior Credo says, "People who sweat more in practice bleed less in war. The person who is the most prepared always wins." You must be fully prepared in order to win. Part-time works always give part-time results. Anders Ericsson, psychologist at Florida State University says, in order to be a master at any field, you need to work at least 2 hours 44 minutes every day for the next 10 years. That is, in order to master anything, you need to give around 10,000 hours of dedicated practice. Besides, you also need to focus on four aspects namely mindset heart set soul set and health set author calls them the four interior empires without which you cannot master any field it is also important to focus on your strengths and not on your weaknesses number 4 day stacking a beautiful infrastructure is built by small bricks similarly a beautiful life is built by beautiful small days in order to achieve something in your life you need to achieve something every day a rock breaks on 100 strikes of hammer but it does not mean that the first 99 strikes were useless if you improve yourself only 1% every day you will get 30% improved at the end of a month day stacking simply means a beautiful life is built by a series of beautiful days so keep achieving every day and move ahead in your life every day now let's summarize what we learned today Number 1 always remember that 
you can achieve anything in your life. Number two, in your life, always focus on one long-term goal, and while doing so, stay away from distraction. Number three, in order to achieve your goal, achieve the core abilities that you need by practicing regularly. Number four, in order to achieve long-term goals, you will have to achieve something every day. Dear friends, I hope you like this video. Thanks for watching.